statistics and why we are here. Now, AIDS in America disproportionately impacts black folks. We're 10 to 12 percent of the U.S. population, and yet we are 50 percent of the estimated 1.2 million Americans living with HIV today are black. Uh, we're 50% of the annual new cases, and we're 50% of the annual AIDS deaths in this country are in our communities. And when you drill down, no matter how you look at it, through the lens of gender, or sexual orientation, or age, or economic class, or level of education, or region of the country where you live, we bear the brunt of AIDS epidemic uh, in America today. So those are the facts. That's the reality. But the good news is, given recent medical breakthroughs, we can end the AIDS epidemic uh, if we come together. We now have the tools to put the end of the, to this epidemic in our community. We have the ability to diagnose the disease. That's why it's important to get tested for HIV. We now have the ability to interrupt transmission of the disease, and we have the ability to interrupt acquisition of the disease. All of these things are things that lead to the end of the AIDS epidemic. But we have to come together to make that happen. Black folks are resilient people. We have been greater than so many things. No, we are greater than the Middle Passage. We are greater than slavery. We are greater than Reconstruction. We are greater than Jim Crow. We are greater than Hurricane Katrina. And we are greater than AIDS as well. And that's what we're talking about at the Black AIDS Institute. Now, there are a few ways that we would love for you to get involved. Today, make sure you stop by the Greater Than A's booth and take your photograph uh, and, and, and talk about how you are Greater Than A's and your deciding moment. We're partnered with Walgreens, and Walgreens is donating that, that big, uh, their, their big billboard in Times Square, and they're going to put pictures, Greater Than A's pictures up uh, on World Days Day, that's December 1st, so make sure that you, that you do that. Uh, we want to thank Nike for the donation of, of the Nike experience. And, 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 and there's a raffle that you can get this great jacket that Nike has done. Uh, also, you know, we think there's a, there's a place for everybody to get involved. So there are postcards out where, where Robbie is asking the question, what if I told you that you could end the AIDS epidemic for one dollar? So if you think that your life is worth one dollar, raise your hand. Who thinks their life is worth at least one dollar? Okay, so this is what you can do. There are postcards, and we're asking you to pledge one dollar a day for a year. One dollar a day for a year. That's all we're asking, to join our Be One in a Million campaign and pledge one dollar a day. You can fill out the card. That's one less Starbucks. That's right, exactly, one less Starbucks. Even Not even less okay. Starbucks a day. So fill out the cards. They can take credit cards, they can take checks. Uh, you can pledge and we can bill you, but please join the campaign. I believe that our lives are worth at least one dollar a day. Thank you very, very much. I agree. I'm going to join. Okay, so I want to bring up Isidore Hall, Assembly Member Isidore Hall.